Theater has really been the experimental theater hub in Atlanta since its founding in 78. This is the place that will do plays that no one else will because they're pushing the limits. Little Five Points has always been a theater's home. It's a, one of the few walkable neighborhoods in Atlanta. And so we are lucky to have a sidewalk on which to perform. And it's the sort of neighborhood where folks that live here and folks that visit here are interested to see something different. Artistic people like to hang out here. It's full of great bars, great restaurants to hang out after the show. So we really operate on that model. We also, we bring in a lot of international work. We're bringing Ophir Nahari back. This will be the second time he's performed in Atlanta. He is one of the consummate masters of physical performance. Uh, the, the things he can do with his body and with his voice. A lot of where I get my sensibilities in the theater is, is from a puppet background. That's kind of where I was raised as an artist. So everything that I create, I come from, from a very visual, a very um, sensorial standpoint. I think a great example is a show we performed it's called Inside Eye, which was the story of a young man uh, growing up on the autistic spectrum. You couldn't see the camera. It was in the eye of the puppets. But then we had projections all over the theater of what the puppet was seeing. And we worked with scientists and neurologists to develop a video design system that mimicked some of the actual sensorial effects of being on the spectrum. People feel like this is a place where they know they're going to be surprised and they're going to be challenged. And that's really what we're all about, is creating new work that speaks to what's going on in the world now. My Atlanta is awake. <laughs>